Okay, guys, here we are now with Hera and Mr. Yo. People that is watching on YouTube, don't forget thank to subscribe, thumb up, and dad. well, and everything. A donation, thank you so much. And I'm showing you this because I want that people on YouTube also see this beautiful overlay. You see all the night maps, and you see the process with the with the bands, you know? We have the Vikings, Japanese, and Bengalis band, Kumans, Gujaras, and Aztecs. Three per player, and now civilization is Lithuanians. Ooh. Lithuanian. How many snipes? One sniper per player. One sniper per player. You can see there all the civilizations and yeah, let's see. <clears throat> Persians, Portuguese, Lithuanians. He has picked, uh, Hera has picked two very strong civilizations for sure. Why Lithuanians is the first pick? I don't understand, really. I really don't understand. I think it's um, too much, honestly. But well, I don't know. Then we have Khmer for Mr. Yo. Khmer for Free Lake, probably. Byzantines can be for Golden Swamp. Very strong. Or any other map, to be honest. We saw yesterday Byzantines in Arabia, and it was fantastic. Hera picked now Mayans and Italians. Super quick. Mayans, Mesosif. Italians, Hindustanis, Mr. Yo, pick Aztecs. He picked Hindustanis and Berbers, not Aztecs. It's always dangerous. Oh, Aztecs is banned. He cannot pick Aztecs. Sorry, my bad. Yeah. Yeah, Mongols and Dravidians. I know, I know. I have said already. I have said already. Mongols and Dravidians. Always speaking Dravidians. Okay. Really, really okay. Now Chinese and Malians for you. You can see that the picks are being quite fast. Faster than I expected, to be honest. Faster than I expected. No Poles, and they are not going to pick Poles. There's no arena. Why Poles? Poles is tricky in open maps, you know? Yeah, but he got already Portuguese and Italians. For, for Northern Islands. Even Koreans can work in North in Northern Islands, you know. Who are the other two semifinalists? Leary and the Viper. It's in the message pin in the chat, guys. Now it's getting harder, and you can see how Hera is taking his time. Hera is taking his time to pick the civilizations. Alright. And if you want, we can we can see the we can see there the players pick the sifts. Well, but the problem is that it's more complicated. I will leave my overlay. You know, I will leave just my overlay. You will see the players' faces during many hours. So we're still okay here. Is that okay? Yeah. Thaldor, that happened because you were in the chat, probably with the channel open till yesterday, right? <laughs> That's why you didn't see the pin. That's nice. Keeping the channel open the whole night. I like it. Burgundians. Poles and Burgundians. Well, they pick both. Poles and Burgundians. Where to go with Poles? Actually, Poles can be interesting with their villages regenerate. It can be good in outcrop. Arena was banned, yes. I'm very sad to don't see Arena, to be honest. Malai. For Hera and Ethiopians, we see Tatars. <clears throat> Honestly, I prefer Yo civilizations. You know? I prefer Mr. Yo civilizations right now. Except the three, four starting for Hera, I think the others are better for Mr. Yo. Seriously. Saracens and Incas. Incas. Ooh. Okay. Yeah, he definitely does. A very solid one. A very solid one. Absolutely. <clears throat> but this water and hybrid maps. Well, there's not that much water. Dravidians is it can be very strong in water and in early aggression. Other than that, I don't see this too much. Burmese. Where Burmese here? I don't know. I'm now waiting for the snipe. You can see guys. Even the snipe got a countdown in the channel. Sick. And now he's gonna snipe. Mr. Yo, he did it. And you want to see the snipes? Oh, boy. Persians and Khmer. Okay. 
they banned Persians and Khmer. Probably the both civil decisions to be played on Fridge Lake, to be honest. Probably both. And now it's time to start the game, amigos. It's time to start the game. Well, why to why to pick Turks in 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 those maps? Honestly, I really don't know why to pick Turks. But uh, let's see. Are they still talking? Let's see what they say. Uh, Jordan and 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 Mister Doubt. Actually, there they are timing attacks here, so they can yep. even use an Arabia enclosed. Also, very good for them. I don't know. I'm really really want to see where he uses them. I'm sure that's one of their main main plan. Yep. Whew. Best of nine coming our way. The other semi-final, Leary against Viper following this one. I won't let you guys go before you give me your predictions. Jordi, Hera against Mr. Yo, what are we thinking? Uh, the prediction I will... anymore, so we yeah. <laughs> we're all blind. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, when, when they showed it, I was like... <laughs> it, it gets small, right, with yeah. all the civilizations yeah. now. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. No, I just think uh, Mr. Yo has stepped it up uh, after the group stage. I felt like they, he was underperforming a little bit in the group stage, and uh, yesterday he has had a phenomenal set against Tado. That was uh, fun to see. However, Hera has just been so dominant, especially in this tournament. And uh, now being at the uh, best of nine, I really think it will be very uh, convincing for him and he will take it home 5-2. Mm -hmm. Doughty? I will cheer for you. Just because everybody says Hera wins, let's go, yo. 5-0. 5-0, oh. <laughs> <laughs> let's go, yo. But uh, Mr. Yo is a little bit older already. But, uh, but <laughs> if he's old, but I'm Asian, like, <laughs> yo is a boy. <laughs> Yo is yo got this five zero. <laughs> After the qualification, I asked Mister Yo, "How do we want to finish?" And he said, "I want to win the whole thing." And then <laughs> I asked him, "If you face Hera in the finals, what would be the result?" And he said, "I beat Hera five zero. So he has the confidence. Doubt supports him as well. It's going to be incredible display of Age of Empires skill, the master Agreed. of sneaky strategies, Mister Yo against the so far unbeaten opponent Hera, and you will be in good hands and good voices with Dash. And Dave, the double Ds. That's the truth. You are going to be in good, uh, in good hands with me. You know that Daz and Dave will be in another channel, but not here. Here is gonna be with me, and now we're gonna be with. Um, mm, it's complicated, you know. You know, in good hands, in these hands, you know, and completely clean. Took a shower, everything, all perfect. Hopefully, we're gonna see now the the domination soon. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Hopefully we're gonna have fun stuff here and uh, it's gonna be it's gonna be nice, okay? And it's gonna be nice. Because we're going to see uh, here I am Mr. Yo, okay? And honestly mm, I think here is favorite, but I don't see this that clear, you know? I don't really see that clear at all. I I don't know what you think, but yeah, we will see. We will see, guys. It's uh, it's gonna be very interesting for sure. Um, I'm going to bring you the pliers now. I think I have the pliers now. Let me just check. Okay. Yes, we have the pliers who are already here. Here I'm, Mr. Yo. Focus. They are not yet uh, on the on the lobby. There is not. So. Well, let's go but i don't see i don't see them in the lobby maybe it's uh capture h book or not no they are not hosting but they are going to be hosting very soon do you see the statistics for the players and everything who is the favorite for you do you think that it's gonna be that clear for Hera? oh that camera what happened to mr yo he don't want to soak his face he's, he's putting already the the monitor there okay 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 well, let's see guys what is going to be? Here a favorite, but prefer your draft. Yeah, well, the maps are not. I mean, I have been talking a lot about the APM. Obviously, the fastest players are in this order: Hera, Liri, the Viper, and then Yo. In this order, according to what Capture H say, right? Uh, Hera is the fastest. Liri is close, and then the Viper, which is also close to them. But is that order? And then Mr. Yo, I have always said, and I repeat it, the, the strategy for Mr. Yo, the decisions, probably he's the number one, right? Or very close to be the number one, but with probably the Viper. 
then if he's on point with the decisions and uh, we can go for the we can go for the draft again these maps is a lot about decisions maybe for example maps like african red bits need more let me remove the camera from here they need more uh about the speed maybe hippopotamus need the speed but also it's a tricky map but the other maps they need a lot about the apm i don't think so right i, I don't think so right that they can yeah i don't know let's see let's see because they are about to start in a moment it's gonna be kawasan i'm gonna bring you again the the pliers you can see it here and the pressure i'm gonna they feel the pressure probably they will feel the pressure and remember guys uh i have a new feature today for the stream i can i'm gonna try to capture replace myself and then to show you at the end of the series or maybe if there's some crazy moment at the end of the game if you notice something that is a man this this is highlight this has to be replayed i'm probably gonna notice myself you know but uh well uh, let's see you know let's see there's those are the people that i think they are in a in a meet and greet that they did in berlin so there's some people as you can see and the most important is that we are starting guys portuguese and malians game number one is starting i only missed one thing you know what to open capture H. But he's open now. And now we are inside, you know, with a and change to best of nine. Because game number one, it just started. Malia Mr. Yo, Hera Portuguese. I think everything is correct. And we have Mr. Yo as a red in the north, as a blue, Hera Portuguese in the south. Civilizations are very good for both. But now I need to put something to make this cool look. Very, very cool. Chinese and Canada and this is uh, seat five if I'm not wrong and Hera number two or three two I think it's two Hera tell me if the seating are correct I did the first time by memory so let's see he's going already to make a dock both players to the same pond so now you can't leave the village going lonely Kawasan is very well known map if you guys want that I explain you the map I will but uh don't think it's super needed i will try i will try anyway we have now malians and portuguese let me show you civilizations overlays these will be there now beautiful really beautiful all right um this map is a mixed map and remember that the water well it's always an extra foot of income a very nice one for sure it's now walling i'm gonna take the short fish and kiss a little bit faster but now he has the fishing ship being created a little bit faster for Mr. Yo. Berries in the middle. In Castle H, a TC here can give you a lot of map control and mostly the food that is free. Two relics on each pond, you know? And the decision. If go double dock, very aggressive on water, or go directly into a barrack and make damage on the land. The games has been evolving and probably the players have been playing better because now they are a lot more used to all the maps, you know? So remember that Hera, Leary and the Viper were invited to the tournament, so they played less these maps than Mr. Yo. Mr. Yo played the qualification, all right? He qualified in the first one, I believe. So a little bit more experience and now mr yo and the viper has been playing two days more than hera and leary because hera and leary didn't have to play run of six and run of eight well that can be an advantage or a disadvantage guys you never know you really never know okay they messed up mr yo camera a little bit yeah i don't know if they're gonna if they're gonna change or they're gonna leave it like this but it's how it is the camera for mr yo Anyway, for the emotions, you might see it in all, but yeah, it looks a little bit awkward. All right. Focus now. Two Lambert camps. Now they will sue. They will go for mining camp, but Mr. Yo already going for the Obama, for the barrack. Oh boy. Four village on goal. Doing the second dog. We see exactly what Hera is doing. He's going for the water. But now Mr. Yo. Uh, need to see it he didn't explore and Hera is 30 seconds 
faster. So, Mr. Joe is going for the second pawn and he's not gonna fight too much here. I like that. It's a good decision. Even more if you're doing militias now. Okay, doing more militias. So he's gonna go for the land. Mr. Yoke himself has said that he likes long series. Long series means that he get the, uh, well, the war map and get uh, in better shape during the series. Well, it's crazy, right? It's true that these players that are super fast APM and so on, uh, do you think they will require that more stamina during the series? Because playing nine games at that level is so hard. Well, for all them, right? But still. Now he's walling. And with these small walls, the mana times probably won't do too much. Well, here, he will get the fish. He's gonna make a demo because he feels that he's gonna lose that one and he's going for the fish. I like it. It's a good decision, to be honest. And now that the scout is gonna be better for you. He's doing the barrack, but he's fully walled. Hera is already fully walled. Those men at times shouldn't do anything. He reacts by as an old Mr. Yo, good job. And Hera is taking already the fish. Quite fast. Mr. Yo will send the demo to the fish. This is what he has to do. And what he's gonna do, Mr. Yo, is explore where where the fish is. And he's taking one. Okay. Well, two, one, three, one. And then he also has fishing ship here. It is okay. Not ideal, but it's okay. Now, the scout took the advantage here, Hera. But he has the mana taps. He's gonna try to break in or not? He's going through that area. And? And? And he's walling. No! Ay, ay, ay. But he's walling in the last second. My goodness. But he can break it. This house is gonna be breaking. No, he's repairing. He's repairing in time. He need to get inside. He didn't get it. And Hera, super fast. But now, he's attacking all the houses. Very smart. Like this, you gotta break it. Or not. He did an oath. HP. Very nice. With only one Valir, it's able to wall everything. Nah, nah. He's not gonna get inside. No RT range yet. RT range already, but the first RT is coming. So at the end... Hera with the advantage. Why? Because he takes the fish. And now he has four fishing fish here. He's doing a galley here. I like it. To defend that one. But this galley is expensive. 90 wood, if I'm not mistaken. That's quite a lot. Okay. Uh oh. He can take two. He can take two. No. He could take two in this side, but he didn't see it. I mean, it's difficult. You know, it's still 3-2 Echo KD. So basically, it's very similar. Obviously, it is, it's working better, smoother the fish here for for Hera. And Hera didn't use the food that Mr. Yo expended. He didn't use the food for the men at arms. And the men at arms are definitely achieving nothing. They achieve nothing, those. Okay. He has the Gallic here. He needs to explore. I think he should be patrolling with that one, but he's not doing. He's coming with the mana times on the archers. Hera's economy is looking good. He has a lot of gold, so he can balance this. And now, he will never do that dog. He has a galley, so that village is just a waste of time, in my opinion. Hera is walling all the map. Mr. Yo is walling all the map. They are going to take any risk? Not really. Mana times and skimmers is coming. He's going to be able to take it? Oh, boy. And now, this is one village down. If he's not just passing. And now, with fletching, he should take it. He's gonna be able to take in time? We'll see. Maybe not. He did it in the last second. Whoa. Good micro here. The skimmers need to help. And. Oh, almost losing the scout. He's not breaking with the mana turns, but it's still open. It's still open if you click. If you click around, it's still open, but again, the plies are not clicking ever. Ever. They don't click at all. He could go inside. It is open, but it's not doing. Because the players don't click. Hera is gonna wall. Yeah, the, the mana times were going. Now he's gonna lose the mana times. 
Did the Meta Times did any damage? The answer is clear. No, they didn't. Any damage at all. Okay. And at home, what? One, two farmers. Four villages on goal. Everything wall. Taking the deers. All good. And Hera. Castellage. <laughs> well, so fast, man. Really, really fast. Really fast to Castellage, man. Mr. Yo, he's not even close. He has the same population, but yeah, Hera's economy with a few farmers. He's doing now the farms. He's looking so healthy. He's gonna be able to Mr. Yo to go up in time? I, I don't know. He's doing arches. Now, the only the good thing is that he doesn't have a lot of farming. Well, actually, I see six archers. Well, he got four archers, two skirmishers, and he's up to castle it. Obviously, if he's able to kill now this army, this is gonna be huge for Mr. Yo. He needs to clean the army before he's reaching castle age. And if he's doing that, he's fine. Because he also has 15 ships. What happened? Guys, what happened? He deleted his dog. Mr. Yo deleted his dog. He deleted the dog. Probably he was trying to delete the palisade and he deleted the dog. Well, you can see the pressure, man. You can see the damn pressure. Oh, boy. Oh, really, boy. Aye, aye, aye. Aye, aye, aye. Anyway, I have activated something. I have activated something, but... Uh, you have to tell me, guys, if the uh, the stream is still as well uh, as good as always. It is still normal, guys. Check the resources. These resources, these resources are sick, man. These resources are sick. No, no, he deleted. Uh, he deleted clearly. Don't have to show anything. It's obvious that he deleted. And now he's gonna t kill that villager, that the scout. The scout is. 1 HP, he's walling, and now he's on the way to Castleage. Mr. Yo, with more population. But here and now, he's sending back all the villagers. He's gonna make a TC in the middle. And the timing, the momentum, it's for Hera. Doing a stable. Actually, double stable. But Monastery in front, he got the crossbows. Now he's sending some archers. Population is the same, but 3 TCs that fast is pretty sick, actually. He's really, really sick. He's doing bloodlines. <clears throat> Skill bar in armor. He's now going to make a tower on the goal, and I think it's a good choice. It's a really good choice. Yeah, he's walling all the map, and he's doing some good decisions here. Going to make the mining camp. Now he's moving back, and if he's fully walled... Oh, he still need a minute, guys. He is still a minute. He is still a minute. Hera is trying to break in. The problem? He's attacking the mill. And now the stable. Need to click the palisade. Palisade is going down super fast. Like really, really fast. That's why he's doing a couple of houses here. The house here better. To go and drive him through the town center. Those knights with double stable, bloodlines, skill and armor and attack. They might be fine and old. Population is similar, but... The boom now for Hera is going to explode. And guys, with three TCs, Hera still with 19 seconds idle tone center. And that's pretty sick. Really, really sick. Siege workshop. And that's the problem. One player has to invest on a tower, on a siege workshop, double stable, going knights. And the other player is just doing three, three stables, the farmers, and monks already. So... The monks is gonna deal with the knights, and the crobos is gonna deal with everything else. My goodness. <clears throat> oh, he's doing a scout already. Okay. But the scout is not gonna work against this. He will need light gifts at least. The scout is because of the... Oh! Oh! Uh, he's gonna make a fire galley now, but you got a, a galley, and you didn't deny the dog. Well, Kera, for now, is still playing like in the group stage. So clean gameplay, perfect, but this is not how it started, how it's finished. And, of course, let's see what he's now, Mr. Yo, going to do. He's doing husbandry and light caps. He's gonna take the monk? He will take the monk. Yeah, the monk is gonna be down. Kill it, and that's a scout is worthy. Now he needs to send the, the siege. The siege is at, at home. He should go with the mangonel, and... 
Oh boy, with the galley there. Thank you for the raid. It's gonna put in between, not really. It's hitting, but the way the fire galley. There's a lot of to multitask. And the multitask is gonna be a problem because with two monks, you might convert. If he focus. But now, ooh, two monks with a light cap. Okay, and now a third one. Ay, ay, ay. Okay, just passing. I like this. Now he noticed. A little bit delayed, you know? I think he got China lag. You know? Oh, no, wait. They are in a land. Okay, forget, guys. All right. And now? Knight, light cap. Okay. Has to be careful. One. Three monks. And the TC here. Third all center. But, guys, the boom. The boom he has right now is sick. Like, really sick. Where he's gonna go with the fire galley? He's trying to... Oh, he can repair. Nice. The only thing that I like from your position is that he has mobility with the units. The problem is, he needs a lot more units. Redemption, Ballistic, he has all the upgrades. Hera is playing the, the boom style. Boom style that has given him a lot of success. But we have seen Hera in different roles during the tournament. Being a lot more aggressive. But in this one, with Portuguese, having the water control early, not losing the fish. Oh, oh. The sanity, man. Sanity helped him a lot. This this upgrade with the 45 HP save all the monks. If he didn't have that upgrade, he would lose them all. And now he deleted. How you gonna now make any damage to Hera? It just looks impossible. It just looks impossible, you know? That's pretty sick, guys. Pretty, pretty sick. Okay. One, two, three, four farmers. Now, another stable, he needs to spam a lot of knights. Guys, he's going Imperial, man. Do you feel that the game has passed already 25 minutes and not a lot of battles? I mean, if there is some KD, and he's up to Imperial. And then the game is over, guys. Or not. I mean, with this population, 112 population, and Mr. Yo, 73. Um, what Mr. Yo can do? He has two knights and three light caps. He's up to Imperial, guys. He's on the way to Imperial. So he is still playing the same way that during the group stage. The game will still go for a little bit more. Well, with Mr. Yo, for, for probably a lot more. But how he can counter this army? And not only the army. It's almost 30 villages difference. What the hell? That's pretty sick. Super smooth. Well, he's losing here some. Eh, that's nothing. <clears throat> now keep going. With the monks, with the archers. At least he keep the, the, the pawn, but... Well, he's doing all the upgrades. He knows that he really has to make the upgrades. And he has the plus two, plus two. But he got light cast mainly. Light cast killed the monks, but archers with ballistic? Hmm. We'll see, guys. He buys some food. He balances the economy a little bit. He's going to the middle. But the only bad thing for Hera is that he has no stone. But you also don't need a stone if you have this food. 55! Guys, 55 billion of food, man. Are you for real? Yeah, another water? Also gonna be for Hera. And this is total domination, guys. This is first game of the series. Semi-final, best of nine. And it's a domination already. I don't know what you think, but looking rough. Looking rough now for Mr. Yo. This is good, obviously. It's gonna kill all the monks. Yeah, but you, you check the numbers and you still get scared. Really scared. It's gonna make a siege war show forward. Okay. But the score difference is just epic, man. Really, really epic. If you got here a couple of mangoes already, and you go with the light caps, then maybe. But why he didn't make a mangoes from here? I know it's far, but still. Face reaction? No, Mr. Yo, don't react. But he might be thinking, how the hell it's possible he's already in Imperial? Well, it's 29 minutes, Imperial Age. And not with 50 villages. No, no, no. He's in Imperial with 102 villages. Now he needs to commit. You have to commit and attack now because you don't want to wait for the upgrades. This is a very good battle for Mr. Yo. He did the Avalis. Well, very good battle. It's the best battle he can take. 
And we, I say it's very good uh, battle because he didn't have the upgrades, but with the Arbalest upgrade already, he has no population, man. He's gonna do a mangonel. Outpost, he's still going, but the score is 2,000 score difference, you know? Yeah, it's the best he could do. The best he could do for sure. But this is really, really hard. He's doing a hand card, block printing. So, oh! Also good man on a shot. But uh, it wasn't terrible for Hera. Yeah, it's, it's absolutely domination. The Canadian has a crazy population right now. And uh, the first game is... This is scary, man. It, it's really scary. It is scary for sure. And just look. Because the Echo KD is one volume more kill for... Oh, okay. One volume kill more. Two more for Yo. But... It's gonna delete the Siege War Shop. Don't want to give him more. The Knights are doing a good job, but... These eyeballs are too strong, and monks are coming. This is getting closer, guys. This is getting really closer. I mean, if Mr. Yo is definitely a try hard and always try his best, that Hera is going to dominate game number one. Well, he did not dominate already game number one, just to close it, to finish it. He's doing the pikes, he's doing the plus two. I don't know if he's gonna try to go around to make more TCs, Mr. Yo. But remember the interview yesterday, that when you are in the first game, you, you like to keep playing. To, to, to get that feeling, you know, with the game, with the with the, with the keyboard, with the setup, with everything. <clears throat> he's still going because he doesn't see traps. But the score is 3,000 difference. Just look what he's doing, guys. He's gonna come with a forward castle. For that, you need to have army. He's sending villages. He see the arbalest. He see with the... Uh, with the galleys, but now he's coming. With those Arbalets, he's probably gonna stop him. Yeah, he's not gonna let him make anything. And guys, this is what you call a total domination. He's gonna make the Halberdiers. Oh, man. Oh, really, man. Aye, aye, aye. Okay, Mr. Yohara doing the castle. GG call. The first game is for Hera, for the Canadian, with a crazy domination. As you can see, 69, 115, 1 0 for Hera, man. Oh, man. Sick. Really, really sick. And, uh, well, what we can say, guys. Military, um, I will show you here on this, uh, this screen. They're going to put, well, uh, the camera, probably. And damn, 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 damn. Military, as you can see, kills 4116. But economy, 9,000 resources more. 9,000 resources more. It's crazy. It is really crazy, you know. Oh, man. For example, I'm going to try to see if what I uh, uh, try, it's working. You know? Let me let me show you. I have recorded something, and I clip it myself, and I don't know if this is going to work. Let's see. What happened? He deleted his dog. Mr. Yo deleted his dog. He deleted the dog, probably he was trying to delete the palisade and he deleted the dog. It works, man. Well, you can see the pressure, man. You can see the damn pressure. Oh, boy. Oh, really, boy. Aye, aye, aye. Aye, aye, aye. This is very good, Anyway. This have very I, good. I have activated some... Yeah. It's not gonna let him make anything. And guys, this is what you call a total domination. He's gonna make the halberdiers. Oh, man. Oh, like really, it. man. Aye, aye, yeah. aye. Okay, oh, I'm Mr. Yohara. This is a test. Doing the castle. GG call. The and first that's game. GG. You see? He's for Hera, for the Canadian. No? I mean, with a crazy domination. And as you can see, 69, 115. How? Once I don't know. I don't know. Okay. We keep going. But I will work to make this more fancy. But uh, I have to discover how to make replays. And I can control it myself. So... Yeah, for example, I have those two highlights for the first game. To be honest, if if then I edit in a video the highlights, what are the highlights we could see for that game? When he deleted the dog and when he called the GG, because there was more a macro game, right? There was more a macro game. No, that, that was just a test, guys. You know, I mean, I'm going to be uh, recording clips. If we have some moments during during the during today, I will I will try to to 
clip it myself. I have set up everything with my stream deck. You kill it a lot, actually. Yeah, but uh, it wasn't decided for the game, you know. When Hera walled out the men at arms. Oh yeah, I could have I could have clipped that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you know, I'm not used yet to that. I need to to pay attention to many things. But I will I will try. I will try. It seems that there is some problems with the monitor. Hera is not there. Is not here uh, there. And I'm gonna put the score one zero for Hera. Let's give the the score. All right. And then we will keep going. Yeah, we're still going now with the with the game two. And uh, as I said, here Ethiopians, Mr. Yo Hindustani, you see the overlays. Thanks God that I noticed. I click it wrong, and I wasn't recording for YouTube. Now it's recording. My goodness. Okay. So if I do not notice that, all my record for YouTube is broken. <laughs> And then I have to render again. Thanks God. Hmm. Okay, he's doing the mill here. This map, remember, the the wood, all the food here is safe. You're gonna be safe. This is the let's say chaotic place that is gonna matter. You know? Okay. He's doing the loom. Hera at the same time. 18 population. They are going to go up. It seems so. Very quick, both players. Very, very quick. The first game has been, let's say, has been quite fast, right, guys? Yeah. And it's looking really like a first game, warm-up game. One player definitely took the, 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 the macro, but we only can recall that he got the advantage for the early lake right taking the fishing ship and then he was ahead with the economy super ahead man crazy thank you for the soup man appreciate it really appreciate it okay it's now doing the barrack yeah barrack for both players and uh, Mr. Yo has the barrack in the opposite side. Well, it's close to the berries, but the barrack is less important because you don't expect Ethiopians to go scout. You expect them to go archers right away. And the barrack is also in the opposite side. Look how both went like if they were in this area. Well, they are in the opposite one. My goodness. Well, this happened when you didn't explore. And Mr. Yo almost hit in the TC again like yesterday. Because yesterday... He eat the tone center, right? In this map, actually. Yeah. In game number seven, he did it. My goodness. Okay, RT range. Now he explored the goal. He see the mining camp, but there's no such surprise. An RT range here. He did the RT range close to his... Uh, to his mill. Oh, the plasma there? No, make it here, man. You see? Oh! A stable. Well, I like the position for sure, but... Pretty sick. He probably thinks that he's doing skirmishes, and he's right. And then he's gonna try to go full feudal. I like it. That's a good moment, you know. That's a really good moment in the game. I mean, minute seven, you don't really see really often to go for this table, you know. So let's see if this moment is gonna matter, you know, or not. Okay. Couple of houses. Yeah, he's already there with the arches. Where's the skirmishes? At home. But Mr. Yo doesn't know that he has a stable. And the scouts can do a massive damage there. If he has no no answer to them. No, no, no. He's coming with another scout and archers. And I'm telling you, three scouts can destroy everything Mr. Yo has. Very smart play here by Hera, man. Really, really smart. 
super fast thinking. And well, since he get the 100 extra food and gold, probably he feel that his economy can afford it and he's not gonna suffer that much. And now, Mr. Yo, gonna see the scouts. Very important too. What is his reaction? Spears right away. Yeah, and a tower, because this is a problem already. This is a real problem already. Obviously now, if Hera is not doing damage, he can so fall a little bit behind in economy, but Yo is not even on gold. The spear is already there. Okay. And now, that is Scout and Archer that was potentially really dangerous. It's not that dangerous anymore. He's doing the blast bit, but he has fletching. For now, Hera is one step ahead over Joe in the whole game. Why? Because Mr. Yo is just reacting what Hera is doing. He's doing a scout. Okay, I do a spears. He coming with arches and he has fletching. I now I do the blast mid. So he is a little bit behind. But he's not taking any damage yet. Gonna try to come here and try to create a big battle. Let's see what he's gonna be. Scout and archers. All together. With the tower, he shouldn't be in a big problem. But at some point he will need gold. And he's now mining the gold. Scout and archers just still going around. He has a spear and coming with four scout and four archers. Dangerous. Fletching already for Yo. The game extremely close right now. Really, really close. Food for Yo, solid. Why? He's not using them a lot. I mean, a few skirmishes, not too much. And he's not doing a scout like his opponent. So he's fine. But he's coming really aggressive. He's coming really, really aggressive now with the, with the archers. And the tower is defending the berries, but not the gold. Skimmers is gonna be fine there to defend, but you need to micro those, and now he's mining a stone as well. Or better say, he's mining a stone, because he's not mining gold anymore. Ay, ay, ay. Ay, ay, ay. That is scout. Just keep exploring. And the two spears, really important to do, to don't lose them. Yeah, the skimmers are there. The scouts are coming. He's trying to commit. Also controlling here in this, in this area, in the south, where the goal is. Oh boy, he's not losing anything. Both are controlling really well. Very nice micro for both. Control everything. Mr. Yo house it. Exactly what it shouldn't happen. I don't like the market there, but guys, Hera is balancing his economy to go up. He's gonna lose the Valir? Almost. The Spear? Almost, but he didn't. Spears and skirmishes. The scouts are coming. He's taking damage. Not really. He's gonna kill the Valir. No, he didn't kill it. He saved it. Now he take the spear. But guys, ladies and gentlemen, Hera, minute 14. He's on the way to Castle Edge already with a crazy and amazing time up. While Mr. Yo is unable, really unable, just to mine gold. This is a crazy, crazy transition to Castle Edge. Okay, he's gonna make the market, and now... You have to be careful, the spears and, and the skirmishers. For now, I see two key moments in the game. When he did the stable, he took all the map control, you know, and, and take the initiative. From there, he didn't, didn't throw a single moment. Hera, sorry, Mr. Yo is not even to attack Hera at all. He's not mining gold. And then it makes that he can go up to castle. It's really quick. Yeah, he's mining now gold at the back. He has a stone here. He's having a lot of stone. So maybe he's going to try to go for a castle and gulams. Maybe. Maybe. Well, he needs to sell the stone and go up. He's not going. Why not? Because he's playing sloppy? Well, because he's not selling the resources. And now he's on the way to castle it. But the problem again is that the timing. The momentum is for the Canadian. And when he's doing these crossbows with Botkin and, and, and crossbow upgrade, well, this arch is crossbows, exactly. It's gonna be dangerous. Really dangerous. The scouts are close. He needs to be careful. Good thing is, he's gonna go for a castle and gulams. And that army is amazing. The castle also might defend really great. He's gonna wall this area. And now, he gotta be scared. He has to be scared. He better need to be a scare. Blue can see that there's gold in the north. So he might know that he's mining gold there. Otherwise, big problems. All right. No botkin. Just Bozo and crossbow upgrade. He's walling. 
Remember that this super easy to kill. It's so weak. The goal. Oh my god. You can't see how he's gonna take now those. He's breaking in. And breaking these is almost a disaster. Let's see if he's gonna make any damage. No, he's not doing any damage yet. But the scout and the archers are in. And he's creating chaos. Stone, 530 stone. Almost having almost having the stone for a cast. He has a spear, so those scouts need to go back. Well, guys, the, the castle is very smart. Still, Hera is trying to be aggressive. But, oh, he lost the villager, and now he's coming with a nice. He took another. He's doing a really good job here. Hera is really, really aggressive here in this game. Completely op opposite of the previous one. Was for the boom approach. Now he's taking another villager. He's taking now three, four villages. Now he has the stone to make a castle. But this aggression for Hera is absolutely madness. Really, really, really madness. So I don't know if this can be the game, uh, actually. Oh, boy. Oh, really, boy. Okay, now as you can see, he's gonna try to make the castle. Nice and crossbows. The crows are here, the tower is gonna defend. But if he's not doing this castle, if he's not doing this castle, it's gonna be the game. Mr. Yo has four villages behind. He's going with the knight. He's taking the army. Ladies and gentlemen, this is absolutely crazy. But Hera is doing a massive damage here. He's gonna kill now the villains, and with that army, he's not taking anything. This is absolutely unbelievable game. GG call Hera with the total and brutal domination. My goodness. Like, seriously, what's going on? Oh my god, what the hell? Well, I don't know. Let's go and check here. But if he's still playing like this, he's gonna be a fast series. 2-0, 154 APM. And people have said that I talk a lot about the speed, man. A lot about the speed, seriously. My goodness, my goodness. 2-0, guys, nothing else we need to check. That APM is not even normal. It's not even normal. Seriously. What the hell? Anyway. Oh, man. Oh, man. Anyway, I have, I have got it some, some clips. to, And I want you to give me your feedback. To analyze as replace for analyze the game completely. If you, have, if you are going to analyze all them, you know? And this is the moment that I think is important, obviously. Maybe I took too many. But I'm gonna see it in a moment. Uh, is this uh, games? I don't know if it's. I think it is. Okay. I'm just gonna show you while they are not starting yet. Okay, let's see. You give me your feedback. This is the replace of the game. To his smell. Oh, the plastic there? No, make it here, man. You see? Oh! A stable. The stable give him all the control. Well, I like the position for sure. All the control of the game, you know? Pretty sick. He probably thinks that he's doing skirmishes and he's right. And then he's gonna try to go full feudal. I like it. That's a good moment, you know? That's a really good moment in the game. I mean... Spears and skirmishes. The scouts are coming. He's taking damage. Not really. He's gonna kill the villager. No, he didn't kill it. He saved it. Now he take the spear. But guys, ladies and gentlemen, Hera, minute 14. He's on the way to castle it already. The replays are great. And I have set up everything perfect. But guys, game number three. Because they are already playing. Let's go, guys. Game number three. It's already happening. We have Mongols and Incas. And uh, let's see. Because the first two games have been real domination by Hera. Hera with the Mongols is very nice. Incas and Meso Sith. Well, it's not Meso, but you know, with Eagles. You know, we will see. You know, we will see. Um, okay, mute the other man. What? Yeah, but uh, how do you think I can mute the other man? I have to mute completely. Oh, actually, I think it's possible. I will take that. I think you can record the replay without the, the microphone. Now, nah, but for the highlights, it's good to have the sound too. Because in mind that I want to make a compilation with the, with the video. It's good. You can mute just the full video. Anyway, let's see. Four villages on wood. Uh, taking the Severus. Remember this map. With the water that is also matter. Stone in the middle. Goal on the left. Goal on the right. But, uh, oof. I'm impressed with the first two games. 
It's a best of nine, still long, but uh, yeah. Mongol free win, nah. I mean, it's better, yes, but you have to play. Even more when you are playing against uh, Eagle Civilization, you know? We'll see. Mongols versus Incas. Obviously, if he's still playing like he's playing right now, uh, you know, well, that's definitely not gonna help. Well, I can mute it. Those replace for sure. Okay, doing the barrack. Mr. Yu is doing the barrack now, but Hera is gonna be up super quick. Like, super quick. They are not going for the water. Yeah, they might go for the water later. Now, it's gonna go up without the loom. He's so risky, man. Well, it's so risky if he's coming with militias. If not, he's fine. Okay. Okay, he's going up without the loom. And that's fantastic. You know, really nice. He's not doing militias. And Mr. Yo still doing more villages. Okay. And now he's doing militias, but Hera has... This is his, his first mistake, you know? If you can call this a big mistake. Obviously, you want to have the militias there, but he has time and oath to, to do it. Oh, man. He's being so fast, man. He's really being so fast. This is so dangerous, man. This is really, really dangerous. Yeah. Two militias. And... He's there already, man. And he can't see it. So he has to be careful. He's gonna kill. I will kill the ostrich. He has the loom there. He has to be careful for sure. Let's see the micro here. He's doing the militia. He's gonna be fine. He has the eagle, but... He's gonna come forward with Belize or not? He's stable, man. He's debated, man. He debated him. Two militias are not stable. Because the stable is more aggressive. It's, it's faster, you know. And that's a really nice moment for Sur. Because again, he's doing some, uh, you know, interesting move. The stable, man. All right. Yeah, you see this and you expect to him to go more militias than the men arm. But he's not doing that. Also, he's not mining gold. He's starting now to make a scouts. He's going now for the dog. No dog at all. So, that's a difference. Okay. He's gonna do men at arms. I don't know if he's gonna make men at arms. But if he's doing, he won't have any economy to do double with tags, to give and do villages. So maybe men at arms is not needed. We'll see. Oh, he's doing a tower. This is good, guys. This is good because now with that tower, he's going to be well positioned here to take the, 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 the ostrich. Also minus stone. This tower is quite fast. And uh, not going to do now any damage. I think right now, Hera is in an okay position, but he's not dominating yet. Let's see. Because now, ooh, two scouts going around. He's going to make a spear. Yeah, but the next one is going to be an archery range probably. Hera doesn't have the horse collar, which, well... It's unfortunate here. Okay. Three scout, two militias. And let's see if he's gonna clean up this well. He has one scout with low HP. If he's not have the spear, he still clean it. He still clean everything. And now he's gonna clean those those militias he took one scout damage okay well Ooh. oh man oh but there's a fire galley that was good he did it on purpose i like it i really like it good move there by mr yo good move there by mr yo all right and he's gonna go back a little bit has to be careful He's still fine here. The short fish is still completely, completely alive. Completely alive. 
because there's a lot more to take. Spear and archer. If he doesn't have an archer range yet, oh, he's gonna go full scout. Oh my god, we have seen this before with Hera. He feel confident with the with the economy, but I'm not sure. He's gonna make the RT range. Okay, that makes more sense now. RT range already. I was thinking that he was going to go full full scout, maybe bloodlines, but no, he's going to make archers. He need to do it. If he start to make a lot of spears, it's a problem. But obviously, you need to control the army properly, and he will. Those scouts, almost all alive. KD three three. Okay. And the archer range there, but where's the blasphemy? No blasphemy yet for any of the players. Not really. Not really, man. Okay. Couple of houses, but map is open. But there's not yet a real aggression. He's now sending those to the dock. He should do a galley here. He's not doing that's a problem. But the scouts are coming. He has two spears and three archers. Mr. Yo, still fine right now. He's in a good position. He's gonna make quick walls or not? Ay, ay, ay. You need to make the quick walls. And he's doing right now in the last second. He made the quick wall. But here, this is a real problem. No fire galley here. It's sloppy. It is a sloppy. First mistake by Hera in the series. Not in the game. In the series. Yes. This is his first mistake. Okay. And now. Oh. Okay. Oh my God. Big badaboo. Oh my goodness. Okay. Ay, ay, ay. Took all the scout with the demo. And here, Mr. Yo changed the game probably. Military and armor is a lot more now for, for Yo. That demo was really definitely doing the job. And well, well, well. He killed it a lot. Here, Hera killed this, but he lost two fishing ships, guys. Two fishing ships. They're still going around. Okay. I forgot the effect because I, re I, re I made the, re the replay. The effect is now with delay. Bam. Uh, I say for the highlights. Of course, I say for the highlights. Okay. Well, but that was an ironic, ironic, ironic uh, smile. Guys, Mr. Yo is now closer and closer to go up to Castellage. But there's a problem. Hera is going all feudal. And now he's going to lose this village, even if he has the tower, man. He's going to go and take the tower. If I was him, maybe. No, no, no. He's going around. Guys, Mr. Yo, good resources. Good economy. Spears and arches. He has to be careful with those scouts. He's going to do the job or not? Okay. Bloodlines forging. Still going with all the upgrades. But his opponent is on the, the way to Castleage. So that's the difference. He's up to Castleage now. And he's going full feudal. He's going to be able to do the job. If he send the archers, well, he has no fletching. He's doing a second stable. He has the blasphemy, but he's doing forging and now fletching. Need to be following, and it is following. He's here and gonna take the tower, man. I, 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 56 population, 48. Obviously, if you're gonna make now army in Castle, it's gonna be a domination, but he has to be careful. There's a lot of farming from Hera. He had a 58 population, 48 his opponent. He has to be careful, not gonna lose those. And now with the archers, he's gonna be there. He's gonna take the tower. The archers gonna kill the spears. Ay, ay, ay. This is an absolutely great move by the Canadians, seriously. Gonna take the tower, gonna kill the spears, taking everything. He's taking absolutely everything here. My goodness. Awesome play here for the Canadian with beast mode activation. Activated 60 population, 43, killing all the army, killing all the villains. Oh, man. He's taking absolutely everything here. Army now. Almost zero for Mr. Yo. Eight villains difference. And yeah, he's Castellage, but Mr. Hera is about to go up. 37 population, 58. What the hell? What the damn hell? Damn. Yeah, he's gonna take the tower. I don't know. I really don't know. Because now the gold miners are going to be bye-bye. And Hera is about to go up. The score is say that he's really ahead. Because he is really ahead. But the problem is that the Eagles are very strong. He had three only. And he's gonna make the upgrades now. Alright. Let's see if he can do a clean up here. 
Kara, on the way to Castle Age. Minute 18. And now he's walling with many villages. And he has to wall. Because if he's just being fine at home, I think he win the game. Like, like 100%. You know, now he's chasing with the scouts. And with this many scouts, he's gonna clean the eagles. Yeah. He's, he's following them. Following them. He's walling all the map. He need to wall this area. Is the only part that he need to wall. And then, those scouts will dominate. He can do light gaps then. And the archers, he's microing here as well. In the meanwhile, he's taking some eagles. Obviously, it's not going to be easy to kill those eagles. But still, he's just fine. Going around. Did he wall completely? He did. Now there is a lot of other villages from here. Well, only those four. Is this, is this wall? Ooh, he's walling, man. He's walling in the last second. Sick. Sick, sick, sick. He's playing okay. Hera is just playing okay. All being said, 49 villains, 39. Not that big difference. He's still doing villains now. He's gonna still 54 min uh, seconds, not minutes, to go up. I think this is all wall. Yes, it is. And he's doing a house here. So, he is okay. And I insist, he has so many scouts. That only means one thing. When he's doing the light cut upgrade, he's just gonna dominate and clean this. Now he can kill the eagle. Yeah. It's microing better. It's microing absolutely better. Controlling and taking the eagles. The KD is similar. But who cares? He has now a lot more army. Well, more army. And now doing the second tone center. To be honest, he did the right move. Lightcat soon. He's gonna make the market. Lightcat and husbandry. Sick. Because those can now do a lot of damage. Yeah, let's see if he's gonna come now with the light caps. Come on, come on. All right. He has the barrack, he has the monastery. Look at those eagles. Ay, ay, ay. He has the light gun now. He's trying to raid. If he overchop, he's gonna be terrible. About overchop, Vilesa knows a little bit because yesterday, sadly, in the last game, what an overchop he did. Now the light can kill the fire galley, probably, and take the fish. Still, now the lancers. Are the lancers eating the eagles, guys? What do you think? Oh boy. Here he's gonna take the fire galley. This will micro he didn't. Now he's gonna kill those fishing ships if he want, but here in this area he makes some quick walls, Mr. Yo, that's nice, but he's raiding and taking this he's, he's going all in, man he's going all in, this moment, man this moment, if he opened now the gate if he opened the gate, if he opened the gate, no he went back, but the, but the light caps are killing all, he's killing the villains here and ladies and gentlemen, the domination by Hera is clear he's, he's in another level right now he's going to convert, no, because now the light caps are coming from behind and he's gonna kill the monk He's gonna kill it or not? He kill it. He kill it everything. And guys, this is insane. Population 66. Mr. Yo 45. And right now, Kara is about to get game number three. He's cleaning all. Seriously all. Whoa. Okay. He's wanting this. 51. No army for Yo. The APM he has is just insane. And I know. I've been telling this uh, during all the tournament. And some people say, well, ma'am, you say too much and so on. But he's huge. You know, I mean, you can notice that this is a lot about the army control or not, guys. You can notice how Hera is controlling all the army and he's not losing it at any moment. So what, what, what we can say? We need to say what we see, right? And what we see is that Hera right now is controlling the army great. Really great. 53 villages, 47, 19 army, is still going aggressive, and probably now even Siege could, could, could work. And with the light cast, he killed another village here. And now he's gonna take the monk. He converted one. That was poof, small breath here for Yo. Another village down, and another one. And another one. My goodness. Wow. Well, he's losing the light cap, but eight villages more. And now it's only going to snowball even more. This is no bowling, man. This is no bowling. Now he's not controlling this. He has to be careful. He's gonna take this one. And he's gonna raid more. The damn Lancers. With the extra HP, with the husbandry, they are doing a crazy job. And now he's just stabilized. He has three TCs. So his boom is now much better than his opponent. That's crazy. Oh, it's, it's over job. It's over job. It's over job. It's over job. And this over job make him lose even more and more villains. He's gonna wall here. He cannot wall. And ladies and gentlemen, 
DJ Cole, what a true domination, man! Sick, really sick, like really, really sick, honestly, unbelievable, really unbelievable, and well, I'm not even gonna check the settings, like, like the statistic, because, well, do you want to see, I mean, yeah, it, it's, it, it's important, you know, it's really important, APM 145.54, 145.54, do you think this matters or not? Is triple, triple the APM, you know, triple. Well, I might be annoying, but seriously, man, what the hell? What the damn hell? Anyway, seriously sick. Really, really sick. Yeah, it is beautiful. So annoying, no, he's, he's playing good, man. He's playing really good, like really, really good. And he couldn't do anything in that game as well. Very good, guys. Like, very, very good. All right. That's crazy, man. That's really crazy. That's really crazy. I don't know if I can put a couple of highlights. The last two. Let me let me just check. Before this is start. Hippopotamus is the next. Let's see if this is work. You are killing all. He's killing the villains here. And ladies and gentlemen, the domination by Hera is clear. It's, it's in another level right now. He's going to convert. No, because now the lighters are coming from behind and he's going to kill the monk. He's going to kill it or not. He kill it. He kill it everything. And guys, this is insane. Population 66. Mr. Yo 45. And right now, Hera is about to get game number three. He's cleaning all. With the husbandry, they are doing a crazy job. And now... He's just stabilized. He has three TCs. So, his boom is now much better than his opponent. That's crazy. The oh, whole... it's, it's over job. It's over job. It's over job. It's over job. And this over job make him lose even more and more villains. He's going to wall here. He cannot wall. And ladies and gentlemen, GG Cole, what a true domination. Yeah, pretty crazy, guys. Pretty crazy. I like a lot, man. I can take the replays uh, with the with the stream right now, as you can see, and we can see the the best uh, the best moments. And uh, uh, I don't know why. I, I think you have time out. Him, he was telling uh, toxic chat. I don't see anyone being uh, being uh, toxic in the chat. I think we are having a great time, and uh, Hera is playing great. And, and what is the problem? What happened? You know, it's it's great. You know, and that's it. Yeah, I mean, when someone play like this, bravo, and uh, and and that's it, you know? Good job, and uh, yeah. The demo reply I have to, but we are continuing with the game four, you know? We are continuing with the game four. I have that demo reply too. But guys, I'm controlling many things now. It's very difficult. Game four, guys. Game four, and here we are. Mr. Yo Berbers, here at Dravidians. Let's see, because now Mr. Yo... He's gonna go with the Villiers. We are in less than one hour. 3-0. 3-0. If it goes so fast, what they will do for the hours? Well, I hope that they are not gonna be... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, man. Could be the first loss for Hera. We will see. He's coming with the Villiers. And those are faster Villiers. This is why he's trying to pick this map. But with the APM Hera has... He's gonna now lose a villager here. What the hell? He's gonna take the boar now, the other elephant. He need to go. What is he gonna do? What he's gonna do now, he's gonna make exactly this. He's gonna try to take it like this. Oh, he couldn't. Because the scout is also there. And now he's gonna kill it. Well, this is the moment where now he kill it with, yes, he kill it with the damn scout. Nice. Very nice. He lay me the elephant. So, but Mr. Yo is already with 23 seconds idle TC. Okay. He has a loom and he's already two villages behind. Obviously, you want the food that he lost there, but 
there's a lot of food in the map still. So let's see what Hera can do in this situation, you know? I mean, it's a best of nine, and that's why there is some chances to, to come back. But man, playing like this, it's gonna be so difficult, man. Yeah, he's housing now. And that's a problem. You need to make the houses close to your TC. Because if not, you're gonna lose. Yeah, you're gonna lose quite a lot of resources. He's gonna take the scout here. He didn't, of course. He didn't take the scout. He's still without the loom. He's still not going for the for the Lamarca, but he's going now. Now probably he's gonna make the loom. And now Mr. Yo is the one who's gonna be housed. That's why he's trying to to make the uh, the house himself. Yeah, he's gonna make you the Lambricam and he has a, a dog in this area. So interesting. Very interesting, to be honest. He did the loom already. And now it won't be a problem for Hera. He has so many villains there, and those two villains, even if they are faster, they are going to die. He's doing a palisade gate here. And you know what? That doesn't matter. He's gonna make a palisade himself. He's happy with this. Yeah. He's happy with this, for sure. Now he's making the house. The palisade, and all good. He's sending more villages. He's the only way. He, and Hera didn't see this. He cannot make the palisade, man. He cannot. And he's sending four, eight villages, man. Eight villages to try to kill. This is the map about... That's why we have not seen the map at all, you know? Because the players just go... This way, guys. This way is what they do. Oh, my God. Okay, and now what he's going to try to do is to trap him. All right. Yeah, this is the, the map about. And let's see if here he's going to have a chance to do the job. Because right now, Hera is going by with that Valir. Okay, you don't want to lose a scout. But the Canadian is up. He's up to Feudalage. But up into what? He does have a lot of food. He need to repair that house. Okay. He's micro properly. You can see how Hera is not losing anything. Mr. Yo is not losing anything. Oh, okay. Okay. And now he will do a tower. My goodness. This is absolutely insane. Seriously. Oh, come on. Really? Seriously. He trapped him twice. And now he's deleting, not losing any villager. Let's go, man. Let's go. Now, where he's gonna make the tower? He's gonna send more villages. He's still not losing anything. And he's three villages versus two. He has to move this one. He's gonna move it. And he's doing a tower. Those three villages are in the hell. As you can see, he's still not going up. Repairing all. Gonna delete that one. And resources, as you can see. This is what you call, guys. Total and brutal domination. And now, he's gonna make fire galleys. He's doing. We'll try to get the fish. Population? Still lower for Hera. That's normal. He's in feudal age. The list there, and the villages are... Oh. Oh! I like it. I like it what Mr. Yo is doing now. This is good now for Mr. Yo. Very good, actually. Yeah, yeah. Let's go. Okay. This is sick, man. Guys, I'm recording a lot of highlights in this in this game. You can understand, right? I'm recording a lot of highlights in this game. Yes. He has triple his idol. Yeah, but that doesn't matter because you don't pay attention to something. He has four fishing ships. Well, Hera don't have them. And it's in this side. So right now, Mr. Yo is ahead with the economy. For sure. Hera need an archer range. When he's doing the arches, then we will talk. But Mr. Yo is absolutely fine. Really fine. No, no, no. You don't want to hangar with some. You don't want to fight against that. You want to just to repair the tower. And when you do two arches, you are fine. You are really fine. He's gonna come with another dog. Maybe. Okay. And he's now mining a stone. He's gonna make a, uh, a mining camp. Probably. Yeah. Okay. Archie is coming, and with the archers, the village will fall. Yeah, this is very good now. In the north, he can see now Hera, the dog as well for his opponent, and he can kill the village. Yeah. You know what I will do if I am 
Hera? I will do uh, Will Barrow, man. Do you, do you get Will Barrow? You can kill the Valleys, man. They, they are faster, man. Archers. So, those Valleys are dead now. Those Valleys are dead. Here's the upgrade foot, but no goal. It's going now for the mining camp. So, he can't make a single galley yet. He can't. He can't do it because he has no goal. All right. Oh, he's doing one, actually. Okay, that's fine. He's sending another galley. And obviously the map, guys, is huge. He lost a valley here. Uh, Hera has killed already the, the three villiers. He's gonna kill three. And now the fourth one. That's crazy. Guys, with all this move, Hera didn't lose a single villier. Or we would say in this channel, how many villiers has lost Hera? With all this aggression. And then we can spam it, man. Zero, man. He didn't lose anything yet. What the hell? What the damn hell? Damn. Zero, man. Zero completely. My goodness. Anyway. He's doing the fire galley. Here is the Lambrican. Only one Lambrican. His resource is still good. Like, really good. So, this is the thing. We feel that Hera is playing this amazing, this game too. But Mr. Yo is still in the game. Yeah. But the problem is that now this fish is kind of idling. All right. Really all right. The three galleys. One moment. That's a good that's a good demo. A really good one. Doing now a good job, Mr. Yo. He has to have two fire galleys, three fire galleys, and one more coming. The archers are coming. Skirmishes now. But this is the problem here. He starts to do skirmishes, he will do the market. But what is the food that he's getting? This is all his food almost. Nine valleys on food. He got eleven. I mean six fishing ships and three valleys. Okay. Where else is he taking food? He is an archer. Five is down. I don't know where he has taken. Oh, here it is. Oh my god. Six is down now. Ay, ay, ay. Coming with more archers. Economy for Yo is looking okay. But maybe with the market. Using the market. He's gonna do some, some scouts. Doing the market now. Nah. He's at the limit, man. Mr. Yo is at the limit. Hera is already passing him in terms of economy. It's true that Ravidian's here. You don't have mobility, but if you reach castle, it's faster. What mobility do you need? And now he's doing a tower. He's doing a tower on his face. He's not even... Yeah, now he's walling this area. He's gonna go up. He's on the way to castle, but... But he's on the way to castle at the same time, my goodness. Like, seriously. Are you for real? Come on, man. Come on. Oh, man. Oh, man. Okay. Okay, we have to be... We have to be careful here with those. He has three villages on stone here. Now, I want to see the following because this is where I think that now Verbers will be better. He's doing second stable. So, Mr. Yo, after all this, he is still okay. You know? And he might spawn knights. But what is now Hera going to do? He got the RT range. He's gonna go pikes. I don't know. Remember that he's gonna get extra wood. He can make obviously TCs. The wood is bye bye now for for Yo. I don't know where he's going to go. And he does have the greatest resources actually. He's doing the bloodless and look at his economy. He's at the limit, while Hera has a lot better economy. Yeah, he should probably make a TC. Well, here is a perfect one. You get gold and wood. 
He could do also here. Uh, let's see. Over 700 foot. What the hell? He got nine archers. He's doing the crossbows. He's doing now a monastery. Respected. Fletching. No horse collar, by the way, for, for Hera. And what is going to make a TC? Yeah, this map is tricky, remember. Now he's doing knights. Couple of knights, but his economy is at the limit. He's doing war galley upgrade, fletching, crossbows. Now he's going to go for some monks as well. So he's going to kill. If he take this, it's a massive damage. He need to go with the galleys, and he's doing the TC where, guys? Where he's doing the tone center? Exactly in the spot that I mentioned, because he's a great one. He's defending the wood, you take the goal, so it's great. And now, he's quick walling, quick walling the gold miners. Quick walling the gold miners. It's a great moment here now for Hera for sure. Okay, ooh, this is also important. He's gonna take some, but he has no defense there. And now this is the good thing with the mobility. He's now finally catching up some villains. He's gonna take two villains here. No, only one, man. Only one. All right, and he has the fire galleys. This is there, and he's now with two tone center. He's gonna take this tower. Uh, yes, he will, because there is no arches. But now here, he's gonna kill all the water, guys. All the water. He's taking even a demo, doesn't matter. He has. Fire shape when well, his opponent is fire galleys. So, I mean, if you repair, you gotta kill it. Alright? You gotta kill it? Ooh, maybe not. Huh? He got it. And now the other one? He can't go. Just go to the fish. Okay, that was a mistake. Well, a mistake. It's controlling many things at the same time. And the crowbars are coming. Ay, yeah, yeah. The momentum here. The momentum here. He got the knights, but he's going to try to micro these. Four knights. A lot of crossbows. There's a monk as well. You can do the job. He to the tower, but still, he's coming with those arches. And now those are with Botkin. Ooh, man. Ay, yeah, yeah. Bada boom. Ay, yeah, yeah. Bada boom. Four billions. He paying attention to damn everything. Come on, man. Oh, man. Well... He's eight villains ahead now. He has the two tone centers. It's just impossible. With this gameplay, with this gameplay, it's just impossible. Was paying attention to everything. It's very difficult for me also to catch up everything, but I'm trying. Well, let's see. Yeah, he's attacking everywhere. He's attacking here, close to his tone center. He was here with the demo. He's sending another four. Well, send another demo. Yeah, why not? All right. Now he need to wall. Let's see. The speed for Hera. Gonna see it or not? Huh? That's surprising. Gask. Okay, he lose a villager. At least he lose a villager, you know? I mean, it's disgusting. What I said with Gask is disgusting, you know? <laughs> anyway. He almost saved everything. He couldn't save that villager. But guys, the population difference. It's a start to be very dramatic. Really, really dramatic in favor to Hera. Because he has now 14 villains more. 14 villains more. And he has more army than his opponent. It's also truth that now Mr. Yo has 11 knights. When the knight has come, you all know what happened, guys. He's going to convert those. He will try to convert one at least. And if he converts, he's going to kill. Well... Oh, man, I hate the monks. How is it possible that he didn't convert anything? And here, this is a great cleanup by Mr. Yo. He took here all, all the damn archers. But he's going to this change the game? We got to see, guys. Okay. He's still here coming with the... Oh, my God. Yeah, it's all over, guys. It is all over. And then he now just need to defend with few monks and crossbows. He's mining a lot of stones, so he will do a castle at some point. And maybe where the castle? In the middle to take the berries? I don't know. But it's 20 villages more, guys. It's 20 villages more. Uh, can you please tell me, guys, check the idle tone center in a map like this. Check the idle tone center in a map like this. I agree with what you say in the chat that Dravidians suck soon, but. If you have this economy advantage and you go halves and Arbales, what else you need? What else you need? You're fine with Dravidians. Like, 
The problem with Ravinia is when you have to defend a lot, but he is in an okay position. He has Stone Center, he has Army, he has Monks. The Knights are coming. Let's see if he's gonna not it quick here. The Knights are gonna raid now some. Let's see if Hera gonna notice. Well, he's human. He doesn't see those. That's, that's, uh, well, well, Hera, are you in the game? D did he drop it? Uh, okay. Good reaction here by Hera. He has a great APM, but my goodness, he's losing so many villains here. Disaster, disaster move here by Hera, you know? Wow, he lost a lot. He really lost a lot. Like, really a lot. But even losing those villains, he is still 12 villains more. And now, he's gonna drop a castle forward. Well, this can cost him the game, actually. It's surprising. Look at the score now. Very, very close. But. Oh! The Mangonel! The Mangonel! Oh, come on! Well, now he does have the mobility, so that's the problem here. He's gonna send the army, but he's still gonna make the castle here. He's coming with the scouts. He has to be careful. He's gonna take the Mangonel with those two villains. And now the monks are there. But the Krobos will kill. Yeah, they will kill. He's killing one, and he's killing now two. With the villains, he's trying to kill the Mangonels. You don't have siege. He's been oh very greedy. And now he's ready here. And still, he's six bullets ahead. In this kind of situation, Mr. Yo feel really good. The micro is still solid. He has to be really careful. This has been a very, very, very greedy move for sure. But he's taking all the villages. He's controlling the army like crazy. And he's still doing the castle. It's crazy that after these ratings, he is still in the game. Now we can still say that that Mr. Yo is still in the game. But Hera is gonna make another tone center. It's gonna be TC number four. And what you cannot do it now, Mr. Yo, is lose knights. You can't lose your, your army. If you lose your army, you will still die even like this. He convert the knight now and he needs siege now. But guys, Hera has lost now 40 villages. 40 villages lost by Hera and he is still ahead. How? I don't know. I mean, how he's still ahead, guys? Oh my god. Seriously, man. That was a quick goal. A very nice one. Now he deleted and he can kill something. But if he's going now here and take this army, and he will. Poof. Ballistic, guys. Ballistic for Hera now. Hera is still with 87 population. Mr. Yo, 61. And this is what I'm telling you, guys. With this situation, Hera has done really some big mistakes and he is still super ahead not as ahead as before but how much army got now mr yo he lost everything guys he really got lost everything and now you're gonna lose the fish yeah he knows that potentially a demo will appear so he's not getting into that area and he's still ready more and more well so difficult for mr yo i would say impossible for you i don't know what you think guys I don't know what you think. He did some mistake, but right now, big deal here. Delaying more and more. And he has four tone centers. Crazy. Really crazy. Anyway. Yeah, the TC is going to be down thanks to that castle. And when he takes the tone center, all these farmers and the goal is in danger. He's in real danger. He's killing so many guys. He's still killing a lot. He's still killing so many villains. This is crazy. 80 villains and 56 again. 25 villains more. That's insane. Seriously insane. Okay. Okay, few villains here raided by by Yo. Doesn't matter. It's Phil. Like, doesn't matter this. Killing so many. 62 population, 105. He has one village on wood. The TC is down in a moment. He's repairing. He's going with the siege now. And well, I don't know what to say, guys. I really don't know what to say. Yes, both are killing a lot of villains, but just check the numbers. The numbers are clear here. 107, 63. And... Uh, And Hera is up to Imperial in a moment, guys. Yeah. He's up to Imperial in a moment. Just look at the farming he has. He has crazy farming. Well, 
This is this is Mr. Yo Economy, guys, basically. He's on the way to Imperial. And guys, Hera is gonna be four Seedal in one hour and twenty minutes. One hour and twenty minutes. Crazy. He's doing a tower here. Yeah. Because he wants to defend the farmers and the stone. But what he doesn't know is that his opponent is gonna be in Imperial in a moment. Morville is down. He's finding everything, man. He's finding everything, man. You know? You know, let me say a joke. If we didn't know that he's in a land, we would say, man, he's watching the stream for Mr. Yo, right? He finds him all over the map, man. All over the map. Total domination. He's doing here an armored elephant. My goodness. Well, when he reaches Imperial, he will call it. I mean, he has to call it because this is insane. Like, seriously insane. Okay. Well, with the elephants, he's taking all the houses. You going to convert or not? Another knight converted. He has the monks. He has the crossbows. He's gonna take the relics. He's raiding here a few more villages. And just look, Mr. Yo has killed more villages than his opponent. But today, Hera sleep well, really well. Mr. Yo is not going to give up because look his resources. He's gonna go up to Imperial. But guys, 70 population. 70 population. He's gonna make the castle here. Oh my God. This is the most disaster that he can do here now. Because now, in 20 seconds, he's in Imperial and the castle is down. Yeah. Oh boy. Oh really boy. Thambrin doing more archery ranges. He's gonna have another 200 wood extra. The economy difference is insane. And well, crazy. Absolutely crazy. He's gonna keep trying because he's, you know, up to him, but it's impossible. With 60 villages, it's impossible. Really impossible. All right. Here are 2,000, 2000 score difference. He's here with the galleys. Gonna have the plus three. And well, pretty sick, guys. Really, really sick. Yeah, I'm saving my voice, guys, as you can imagine. I'm saving my voice. Oh, it's taking the bar rack. Want to, to make the game go a little bit longer. Yeah, instead of killing the castle, he's killing the, he's killing the bar rack. He's feeling that this is too fast. Now he's taking the castle. All right. He's doing the light cast, but... Yes, double stable, all right. He doesn't have the mobility, it's the only, the only bad thing. And uh, it's 3,000 score difference. When the castle is down, he's gonna be housed forever. Guys, unbelievable GG call for zero, guys. For zero, guys. And Mr. Yo has to feel bad, like a co uncomfortable position there because it's a lamp party and then he might be thinking, well, well, I don't know. Yeah, statistics here, 58 APM again, 105 in a map like this with archers. Statistics, military, 1969, he killed more units, guys. But economy, 9,000 resources more. 9,000 resources more. And social, villages different, 50 villages more. Sick, no. Incredible, really, really incredible. Okay, well, we can see then, uh, we can see the highlights of this, of this uh, game. Let me see if I got some highlights a and see if there was some interesting one because they are taking a small break, normal, because if not, the series are over. So better to get a break because this is, this is crazy, seriously. Like seriously crazy. I don't know, man. Okay, let me just see if I can, if I got a few clips and we can analyze this game, but uh, let's see. This is the game number four. Truth, that now Mr. Yo has 11 knights. When the knight has come, you all know what happened, guys. He's gonna convert those. He will try to convert one at least. And if he converts, he's gonna kill. Well, oh man. 
Well, this is the only moment that he, he cleans something. You can see with the knights, he's killing all the archers. But even like that, even like that, doesn't matter. Check the population. It, it's crazy. That was okay, right? But what we're going to see now? Yeah, now, this is where he's losing so many villains. Check the population. He loses here so many villains. A lot of villains here, Mr. Yo, right? But still, look at her population at, at, at that point. You know? You know? It's 4 0, not 3 0. This is the replay. The replay has to put the 3 0, you know? I don't know if you know, but a replay has the actual score. What the hell? Yeah, and, and now here, look, this is a good moment in theory, but he still do the castle. Population? You know? Yeah. Yeah, the demos is another replay that I have too. I will put if you want. And he's still raiding here. As you can see, look at the population at that point. It's almost the same. When he's doing the castle, his population is only 10 population difference. But he still managed to, to make more and more town centers, you know? And this is now the game, you know? What the hell? Do you like this, man? I mean, I will try to... There is a problem that when you put several clips, there's a, there's a cut that it cannot be really edited. But well, it's what it is, you know? Yeah, it was four demos. I think I have the replay too for those. Yeah, let me show you. Uh, I think so. But guys, remember that I'm doing all this on my own. I think. Yeah, I took I took six clips. I think. Okay, let's see. Yeah, it's a massive damage. He need to go with the galleys, and he's doing the TC. Where guys? Where's doing the tone center? Exactly in the spot that I mentioned because he's a great one. That's important because it, it gets all the economy lead from there. Really from there. And now he wallet all, all the gold when he was going to attack. He's been on point the whole, the whole game, except when he got raided. And now, I think, it was a mistake. Well, a mistake. It's controlling many things at the same time. And the crowbars are coming. Ay, 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 the momentum here. The momentum here. He got the knights, but he's going to try to micro these four knights. A lot of crowd was there among as well. You can do the job. He took the tower, but still, he's coming with those arches. And now those are with Botkin. Ooh, man. Ay, ay, ay. Bada boom. Ay, ay, ay. And the bada boom there. Well, pretty sick, guys. Pretty sick. And uh, this is how... Uh, Mr. Yo is playing, guys. Mr. Yo is playing well, but Hera is playing insane, right? It's really playing insane, so I don't know. All right. Well, uh, we got... Um, yeah. It's, it's crazy, guys. It's really crazy. Like, really, really crazy. They are taking a small break, guys. And uh, we keep going, guys. Game number five. I didn't know that they started... And here I was watching the highlights. Okay, let's catch up. We didn't miss too much. We are in game number five. We have Mr. Yo with Lithuanians, Hera with Italians, and I'm here now. And look at this. Mr. Yo on minute one sending militias. Sending militias. Let's see if he can do something. Damn. Well, this is a no uh, very well-known strategy. And now Hera... Well... What a surprise that he saved this, right? Really, really surprising that he saved it. This one with the fast, no, with the super fast. APM, man. My goodness. Anyway, good job. Now, now what is he going to do? Is he going to make fishing ship? Maybe not. The problem with this is that you make these two militias and you create some chaos. But um, it's kind of tricky. Thing is, I have a mod that in some maps is create those big trees. I don't know why, but it's still it's cool, I think. More, most of them are small, but look at the others. They're big as well. What the hell? Now he's doing a fishing ship. He has in the middle. Okay. And another one there. He's on the way to Feudalage. So what you need to do is now mining gold. And uh, all will be fine. Sorry, guys. It's being fast because uh, I didn't know they started. I thought they were getting a bigger break. But we're going to be live in a second, okay? We are almost live already. Yeah, we are live already, actually. Which is when it's going to start all the action, okay? It's going up. This is the beauty of these Lithuanians. That even doing those militias, you can be up quite fast. But 
it still is one minute 30 seconds slower so he's gonna get the control of the fish yes he will and then mr yo probably is not gonna make fishing ships he shouldn't actually didn't have any problem and fire galleys fire galleys are coming now okay and i don't know what you think guys but i prefer italians also over lithuanians i i really do yeah i prefer uh, uh, italians for sure honestly don't think that i mean it's it's almost impossible can mr joe come back he need to win 5-0 in a row to hera and hera playing this way you know is i don't know man i really don't know let's see i let's hope that he can do something he has two militias he's doing the barrack now let's see here the speed for hera again well but he's, he's close to the tc so yeah he's gonna make a palisade probably he's not even doing a palisade what the hell yeah, because this spot is not bad. Now he wallet, so he's fine. And now the goal, no problem. He's gonna make the fire galleys. He got already two fire galleys. Okay. Yeah, he has to do it. This is kind of weird. When you are that behind, you also make two dogs. Shouldn't Mr. Yo go for, for, for the land already? Because right now he has a barrack only. And then Hera is already exploring his opponent to see what he's doing. Yeah, I don't know. Anyway, we'll see. Gonna make two fire galleys. He's gonna make a demo too. And he's gonna try with the demo to snipe the fish. You see what he's gonna try? Two militias and what he's gonna do now? Archie range, playing safe. You don't have to play aggressive. Doesn't need any aggression. Hera 13 seconds idle TC. It's uncommon to see him idle TC, but now he got some pressure. So it's, it's more normal. Archie range will be up soon. He's doing with one volley only. Uh oh no 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 well it's forcing him to go around he lost a billion now this is not a good position now for Hera. He's gonna lose another. This is gonna be this is gonna be bad. He's gonna kill it or he's gonna save it. I think he's gonna kill it. No, he saved it, man. Ay ay ay. Okay. In this area, there is now a lot of galleys. A lot of galleys, but he still have four galleys, three. Mr. Yo is gonna keep trying his best for sure. I mean, if he's 4 0, he's just gonna try to focus game by game. And now, here with so many galleys, if he's cleaning these, it's gonna be a real problem because the dogs are gonna be useless. And then, as you can see, he's taking absolutely everything with the galleys. He has to have the fishing ships alive. And it's not looking good for Mr. Yo one more time. Population is a big difference already. He got here skirmishes, but he's now doing. Archie rings is stable and the blastmith. My goodness. Okay. Well, he's trying to kill, but he can't. He's gonna have a demo. Well, he's annoying. He just needs to, to attack with those. He's trying to go for the archer, but doesn't matter. Now he has the archers here. And if he's doing one scout, he's housed it. Man, just look. He's controlling the fish. He also moving the village, didn't lose. He's doing the blastmith, producing archers. Doing the scouts, doing the houses, it's like five, six tasks at the same time. You know? Five, six tasks at the same time. And now those archers, with getting the hill and with the scout support, will clean those skirmishers. Yeah? And he's also killing the archers here. Aye, aye, aye. KD, 9 2. 9 3 now. But the scout is coming. So, nothing he can do. And if he's sending here a few fire galleys. He's gonna dominate. He should send the galley, and that's it. You know? He's not sending now, but he's sending more archers, so it's okay. Yeah, the scout will kill the archer. The archer has no fletching. He's doing a demo shot here, but not a big deal. He has to go back a little because they are very low HP. But population is 10 population more. Look at the score, guys. Look at the score. Because the score is... 
talking by itself, speaking by itself, it's 700 score difference right now. Maybe the folk. Well, you, you can see how the, the exploration matters a lot here, you know. But still, it's 11 population more. He's coming now with the archers. Those are going to be with fletching. He did a tower here, but he definitely has not a lot of army. He has to be careful with the spear. Yes, and if he kills the spear, he has the army. Okay, he's recovering a little bit of water. That's good. Mr. Yo is recovering the water. If he's not doing galleys, he might recover the fish. That's solid. Population is still a difference, but he's now here. And with the archers, he might kill the spear. He's killing the spear. Yes, he will. He got the fletching. He got the fletching. Ah, yeah, yeah. Well, it wasn't the best trade here for, uh, for Hera, but it's still fine. And now he's attacking here with the scout, with the spear, with the archers. He's going to go to the wood line. He has a good amount of farms. The scouts are in danger. Not so many archers. Military numbers drop it a little bit. He has now the galleys. Not really. And he recovered the water. It's raining less. Now... Now it seems that it stabilized the Chinese, but Hera is a spamming army. Is the problem? Is it's not a that big difference anymore in the score? Because is why he's not doing galleys? I don't know. This is weird. Why he stopped doing galleys? No clue. He's gonna lose a fish. You don't want to lose a fish here with with Italians, but he's gonna keep going with the four scouts and three archers. He's gonna be able to do the job. If he kills the spear, he will dominate. He has nothing to stop this. He has definitely nothing to stop this. And the tower is in the other side. Oh my god. He's gonna go and take this one? No. But it's now he's doing houses. It's still even losing the fish. And population now is almost the same. Okay. He's still being aggressive here with many scouts. How much farmers he has? Oh my god. A lot of farms. Seriously. Sick. Crazy amount of farms. If he find a hole... Well, there's not a hole. Everything is wall as you can see but guys it really looks that the economy even losing the fish it's much better for the canadian much much better for the canadian it's coming with few skirmishes and ladies and gentlemen as you can see he's about to click up to castleage right now and that's a great moment 18 minutes 40 seconds while his opponent has no resources at all All right, that's the time going up to Castleage. That's the time up going Castle. And now he's doing fish. Ooh, okay. Yeah, man, he's crazy, guys. He's really, really crazy. He lost some, but his echo is much better. He has no stone. He's doing the bloodlines. He's gonna go now full aggressive on land, ignoring completely the water. Pretty much ignoring the water. Well, he has a demo. Maybe a demo is good to, to clean some of this, the fishing ships. But guys, military numbers seems the same. But the quality of that army is not the same. It's definitely not the same. And it's not going to be the, the same when he reaches the castle age. My goodness. He's doing a tower here. Okay. Yeah, but that tower is just going to give him time. A little bit of time. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. The fish? Well, you're gonna take one. Maybe not. Now he will take, take one. All right. And now how you stop this when he reaches Castleage? His resources is still far from going up. No. Well, it's one scout only. So that was good for Hera also. Need to go, need to be careful. Population. Now Mr. Yo with more population. It's the first time probably in the series that he has more. But he's still far from Castleage. When he's doing crossbows and knights. It's just impossible. Or is what I think. His economy is really solid right now. Crossbow, Botkin, Bozo. He's still not up. How are you gonna stop this? I don't know. He's gonna kill those five. GG! 5 0! Mr. Yo didn't even try. Crazy performance by, by my goodness. Oh man. It's crazy. By him. Really, really crazy. Great. Moment by Hera, man. Guys, 5-0, guys. Incredible. Incredible. But, well, Hera has been playing so great and uh, he dominated. He dominated 5-0, man. 5 damn 0 Let's check. Poof. Let's check the, the, the statistics. 
with 65 APM, 114, it has been the series like this, doubled APM, and military, you can see 2018, but economy, crazy, really crazy. This has been the biggest domination that I remember in a long time, guys, in a semifinal on an S-tier tournament. Crazy. Now, let's see the interview. Dude, what was that? That felt pretty good. I hope it felt pretty good. 5-0 against Mr. Yo, matching your set victories with map victories and score in this one. Was this close to expectation? What was your thought going into the series today? Um, I mean, I, I went in uh, pretty confident, but also, you know, pretty cautious because Mr. Yo is a very dangerous player. Uh, I actually put in a lot of preparation last night as well before going to bed, so I wanted to make sure I'm, you know, tip-top shape for the set, and all the work paid off, and uh, yeah, it was pretty good. You, you mentioned that preparation. I know you asked Nilly, how late can I stick around? Yes. You were here into the wee hours of the morning. Um, do you feel like that preparation was the reason it ended going in in the way that it did? Um, I mean, not just that one. Of course, we had like the boot camp bef you know, before the whole tournament that really helped us get into the mindset of a big tourney. Uh, but I think the preparation before, you know, last night before the set was huge as well, just to kind of, you know, dot the T's or dot the I's and cross the T's, you know, just make sure everything's perfect. Did anything go wrong other than losing the one villager in this game? Did anything <laughs> go wrong for you here? Because it felt like you got Portuguese and just steamrolled right to the right to the end game yeah he should he should not let me get portuguese here i think uh that's probably a ban or a, or a snipe because the sieve is just so strong like as soon as i get the center i'm just feasting on the berries getting wood and uh and food a few things went wrong i, th I think in like the mid game he had some nice raids uh, he picked up a lot of monks as well but the strategy for me was really good and after i won water i felt confident yeah, there was just a singular moment where I think, you know, five monks go down to light cav, but mm -hmm. there was really no point where you seemed on the back foot. We go to enclosed here, Hindustanis, Ethiopians. Talk to us about this build because it felt so tight and the early stable caught your opponent way off guard. Yeah, so I said the other day we didn't show preparation. This is the first one, and this might be one of the best tournament games I've ever played. I think this one was really, really good. Like, I, I made almost zero mistakes, even micro in this game, so I felt really good about this game. Um, and yeah, just... This is just the work that we did uh, in the boot camp, pretty much. It was so weird, too, because he saw your scouts early, and I feel like his defense for what you were making was actually really good, considering yeah. you went on to skirms, and there was, like, one unit killed until Castle Age. But it still felt just inevitable. Like, when you said it was mm -hmm. one of the best tournament games you've ever played, it felt like he didn't have a chance at any point that game. Yeah, that was... Uh, he did better than Leary in practice games, I'll tell you that much, but I just don't think he can do that much against uh, that strategy. So, you know, something to watch out for in the finals if Viper makes it there. Yeah, that was a terrifying demo shot that you took. Oh, uh, that was crazy. <laughs> scouts there. Oh, no. Uh, but once again, it was this combination of scouts and archers that you seem to be able to produce every time in Feudal Age and then finding fights like this where you could get good amounts of eco damage while still close to matching your opponent in like a push towards the castle age yeah th this game was really interesting because after i lost the demo scouts i had to make a decision do i make more and commit to feudal age or do i just go up and try to get the step lances faster i decided to make more to force something like that uh, but even after I got this big engagement, I was really scared of the Eagles. So you see me panic walling the whole map. Not something I do in a rated game. I'd be like, whatever, let's just try to defend. But in a tournament, I want to take zero risks. So right now I walled in my base and then I played step lances after. And I felt like that was the right decision. Do you think there's anything more he could have done there in the early stages of Castle? Or was your military production just enough to smother? Mm, I, I thought my Civ was just better yeah. in general. Like, this was his last pick versus one of my first ones. Uh, so it was kind of hard for him to do much. I thought he actually did really well with what he had, to be honest. Yeah, finding the hole there, too, in yeah. the perfect moment. It's inevitable. The there's just too much going on. Okay, just, <laughs> I mean, try and help us make sense of this game because it was chaos kind of from start to finish. But, like, what yeah. were your thoughts as this was playing out? Thing is, we also practiced this last night because I knew he was going to do it. Uh, he, he did it versus Winchester, and he just loves this kind of stuff. And, uh, yeah, I, so it was Nikov that told me, just take some stragglers and uh, you'll be fine until he, you know, until he you know, moves away with his villagers. And so I just took my time to go to the woodline. Once I did get there, I had, you know, Loom, I had my economy, and I had the Fast Feudal. And I was actually banking on walling in his villas with the tower. That's the whole point of the Fast Feudal um, there. So it worked out really well.
There were God. some that epic. Wasn't even, that wasn't even the biggest one yet. Hera, Hera, I was super proud of you, dude, because I'm always saying, like, stray demos, just send them. And you were sending them, and you were finding yeah. picks, man. It was yeah. crazy. Yeah, yeah, this map is absolutely wild. I think we, we both had, like, three, four good demos uh, on those villagers. It's insane. The fact that he keeps these low-health vills up here, for, and he was, like, repairing in the face yeah. of your fire ships. These are finally when you take a couple of them out. Yeah. But we were so impressed by his gutsiness. Oh and this my was... God. Bro. The biggest demo in the history of demos. Eight villagers go down. <laughs> That's crazy. Like that. I was getting raided at the back, though, so I was like, oh, because I was watching the demo. Yeah, like, yeah. I'm a player, but I'm a fan as well. Like, I got to <laughs> see what happens, but uh, I had to quickly, you know, tie back into tournament mode and, uh, and watch those raids. Yeah, this point in the game, you have uh, a very substantial lead, but there was a point where you went from a 20 to 25 vill lead all the way back down to like evened up at 55 to 55 oh, wow. I'm wondering, did you even have that sense that he had gotten that many eco kills with the Knights? No, nah, I didn't even realize what was happening half the game. The, the game map is too crazy. I couldn't really read what was happening. And I didn't realize how I got so far ahead in the end, to be honest. Like, that was a weird one. Also, just uh, that single Arbalest kill on the Magno yeah. was so gross, man. Yeah. So I, gross. I did that just for you. I know he hates that. He hates when I micro, so. So you went into Frigid Lake. He goes for the Drush. You just take the fish anyway. You're ignoring the militia completely you take water and then you go really early into not only an archer range but a stable follow-up behind that because yeah. Udiko is better than his I mean were you confident from the beginning did you know the drush was coming in no I had no idea in fact I think I got a little lucky there um, because I I saw the militia and I was able to quick on my bill um, had that not happened it would be a lot messier um, but yeah, I think as soon as I saw the drush, I was pretty happy once I walled in my vill because I knew he wouldn't be able to match the uptime anymore. And I felt pretty good about Italians having the middle. As well, I think it was like the little things, right? You found two vill kills with your starting scout. Mm -hmm. One pretty early on, and then with like, he was one shot away, but just again, because of the messiness of the game, you managed more. to get, oh, two, yeah, we, was, okay, we missed yeah. one of those then. But yeah, the walling villagers, we like looked back, we're like, are you kidding me? Of course, because still going to get it. There's like water fights, there's the land fights. So if you just right click the scout, the scout's useless. So, uh, you know, it just make it harder for your opponent. And it, I got two kills rewarded for that. So give him another something yeah. to pay the, to. The game, like the maps are so fun in this tournament because there's so many things going on at once. It's not like the full wall into like macro 3TC, which I really, you know, don't find fun to play. These maps are like action everywhere. And that just, you know, I think just brings the best out of players. Do you feel like you're playing the best Age of Empires you've ever played in your life? Either between now and Red Bull. Uh, even though Red Bull wasn't a good result for me, I felt like I was playing really well then. Like I lost a title in the semis and... I mean, it was a good result, but it wasn't exactly what I wanted. But I felt like I was playing really well then. And I'm playing really well right now as well. We'll see what happens uh, in the finals. Are you kind of nervous that you won 5-0 and you didn't like get as much time or potential <laughs> practice in for your finals appearance? Because uh, I'm assuming whoever makes it through that semi, which is ridiculous, Viper and Leary, yeah. is going to be a tough cookie, dude. Yeah, exactly. Like that, That's definitely going to be the hardest match of the tournament for me. Um, I'm not really worried about the warm-up because you know the chairs are really the chairs and the desks are really good. I'm not even selling out right now, <laughs> but the chairs and the desks are really good. Back force and lead desk, by the way. <laughs> yeah. Like they're they're so right, good because right <laughs> I can adjust them exactly how I want them. So whether I'm sitting yeah. there or in the practice room, I feel like I'm playing very comfortably, and yeah. that's really important for me and pretty much anyone I'd say. Very, very important. Well, let's talk about that uh, remaining semifinal of yeah. which you will face uh, the winner of the set. It is your teammate in Leary up against the Viper. How are you feeling about the set overall? And without revealing too much about strategy, I assume yeah. as much as he was helping you last night, you were helping him for his set today. Yeah, yeah. we both got in some good practice, some last minute preparation. And I, I think this one's going to be a very interesting set. Um, you know, they did match up in the group stage and Leary was able to take that pretty you know, comfortably. Oh, that's a big oh, donation. Dude. Yo. Holy I moly. thought that was $53 yeah. there. <laughs> yeah, this is crazy. Well, wow, thank you. But yeah, I, I thought, um, you know, the group stage match was, you know, fair enough, very dominant from Leary. But as the tournament goes on, stakes are higher. And, you know, it's a best of nine. It's a reset. Both players have had time to make adjustments and prepare. I think it's going to be a really close set, to be honest. I favor Leary, but I think it's going to be a close set. Yeah, Vipers had... Man, imagine if Viper goes to the final, though. He's going to be having one of the craziest runs considering yeah. the the sickness and everything he's had to go through. But Leary, like you said, is just cr is the only person to take you to five games mm -hmm. in this tournament. And 
I think there was a chance for him to actually do the reverse sweep on that set too. So yeah, that that was a really close one. And I think in general, Leary is the kind of guy that thrives on these kind of maps as well. Yeah. Uh, as we see him preparing right now. I don't know who he's talking uh, to. Yeah, who's giving him the pep talk? That's the question. He's showing off the guns, bro. <laughs> Ticket yeah. to the guns. That's the intimidation <laughs> factor. I think he's sitting like directly opposite uh, Viper too, right? So uh. yeah, he see he sees himself now. But uh, but either way, I think Leary's going to be very uh, very prepared for uh, the this smiling. match, and it's going to be a, a really really nice one to watch. I, I will say I like playing in the morning, so I can chill now and relax and enjoy the set as well myself. And you're a fan too, so you like to watch the game. Exactly. Yeah, yeah I've been watching a lot of games, so. Yeah, it feels pretty good. I do want to check in with Nilly on what the approach is here for draft uh, about who who would cover it. Is it going to be us three who you want to stick around and talk through it? Or? Guys, this has been the semifinal. I just make it a small pause because this is the video for the YouTube. Hopefully, people on YouTube, thumb up, subscribe, and leave a commentary. Total domination by by Hera. Total and brutal domination.